Hello, my name is Lubo Terek. I'm the developer of Quantsense application and in the first part of my video tutorial I would like to show you some introductionary steps so that you can quickly start working with the application. So the basic step is uh, creating an account where you will store your trades. If you have no account in your application, Quantsense will all you always ask you if you want to create one. So on this question just click yes and uh, all you have to enter is the name of the account let's call it or call it test and the currency of the account i will pick euro and that's all every time when you are in this trade screen and uh, you select an empty account consoles will show you or provide you with this dialog where you can basically uh, pick one of two operations first one is the importing trades uh, from a source uh, from a file and the other one is just to enter uh, the trade data manually uh, trade by trade so pick the first option import trades and select metatrader for this is a file type which contains trade history report from metatrader 4 so the other option is for uh, the results of uh, strategy simulation in MetaTrader 4. We will come to this later in some other tutorial because it's more complicated and more suitable for advanced style traders. Click OK and uh, pick a file containing the trade report from MetaTrader 4. So in my case this file is called statement01. Click open and file will be uh, imported into Quantsense. It was that quick, as you can see. And we have 113 trades already in Quantsense. Okay, after this import, we can try another one. So we will go to account screen and we will create really the other one. Click edit and you have again our account edit dialog where I enter it demo as a name of an account and again I will set euro as a currency for this account and now we have two accounts currently so go back to the trade screen and select demo account and deselect the test account so now we have a uh, demo account selected and as you can see Quantsense detected that there is no, there are no trades in this account so again we have this option so click import trades meta trader 4 and i will import another trade source um, in this case it will be demo statement open and that's it now we have something like 14 trades these are the trades that uh, Quantsense will import automatically in the first run uh, if you choose to start with demo uh, data and as you can see here we have 14 trades with only small small number and in the in the test account we have 113 trades and now look what happened when I choose both accounts click and as you can see now we have all trades displayed in this list and as the statistics in the top right corner has changed so we have altogether 127 trades and with uh, overall profit 162 euros so you can in this way you can narrow your selection of your trades only to one account both accounts and moreover there are some other uh, possibilities how to how to perform your selection of a trade so now let's try to do this uh, in this uh, drop down menu you can uh, you can select only one type of trades uh, depending on the instrument so let's uh, pick us 30 for example this is dow jones index and as you can see we have uh, consoles has displayed only the trades which has been made on the instrument called us 30 and these are these four trades and there was a profit on this trade altogether so four euros and 84 cents for example uh, moreover we can do some uh, more narrowing of the selection like this as you can see all the trades are from august 2014 so we can do a small experiment like uh, we can narrow 
code is from 18 August to 20th August, like this. Again, you can check August 24 and click update. And voila, suddenly we have only those trades which have been made in these three days, 18, 19 and 20. So this is how this uh, trade navigation component works. It always uh, somehow specifies your selection to some special group of trades uh, according to your preferences and all these trades selected, selected in this way are entering all of your computation. And the last thing I would like to show you is that you can import your trade history, your full trade history every day uh, without any problems. So uh, let's go back to one selection. We will have uh, the test account selected. Uh, I will just get it to original state. Uh, we have listed all of the trades. It's 113 trades here displayed in this list. And we will import the same file again just to show you what will happen. What will happen. Uh, it was the file statement 01. So select it and click open. As you can see, uh, Quantas is importing trades again, but uh, here is a list of trades which Quantas detected that they are already in your systems. Um, they will be not imported again. And you can check how many duplicities you have here in this list and then just click close. And what you see now is that nothing has changed in this statistics. We still have 113 trades with the same profit and uh, no no tr no new trade have been imported meanwhile so you can import your full history every day and constant will pick only the new trades for importing so uh, i think it is uh, very user friendly and it will easy your imports into the application so this is all for this tutorial and in the next one we will check uh, the charts and statistics computed by constants. So, so far, thank you for your attention and see you in the next part.